Okay, so I thought I'd do this video as I have uh, friends and family in affected regions with the coronavirus outbreak. Um, essentially, this stuff, uh, alcohol gel, is in very short supply, I suspect. And it's one of those things where I've been trying to think about what would be an alternative. So I ended up speaking to a microbiologist um, and we were kind of working through what would be a good hack. And so I stress this is a hack and it certainly doesn't replace, um, it's not a substitute for any official advice um, out there on how best to deal with this. Um, I'm not an expert in this place, but kind of thought what would, what would be good to use is maybe something like 40% uh, alcohol. And so this, in this case, vodka, and cutting up something like a t-shirt or a tea towel in small cloth pieces. And then I think the key thing here is essentially putting them uh, in plenty of alcohol so that it's fully submerged. And uh, I guess a good point here is keeping these two things separate so that these are clean and dry and you're only using them at the point of use. The second thing to bear in mind is maybe don't carry around lots of uh, flammable liquid, uh, alcohol in this case. Um, so just use it sparingly, either in a jam jar or a small flask, if that's a little bit uh, safer for you. So I think what, what you can do now is basically um, wipe your hands down, taking some care to work it into the bits, especially fingertips and things that have a lot of contact. And obviously doing on the same on the other side. But it might even be that you think, just for safe measure, wash it again twice a little more liberally, wiping it off so it's really quite quite soaked. So, with that in mind, um, what you've essentially got here is two pieces of cloth that are soaked in alcohol. There is a little bit of a fire risk here, so I think it's quite sensible to essentially take a Ziploc bag, put them away carefully so that you can carry them home, because you wouldn't want to just leave this in a public place. Um, and I think what would be good is either to dispose of them carefully when you get home, or indeed if you must reuse them, it's an ideally single use, but if you must reuse them, boiling them for 10 minutes before you reuse them very, very thoroughly. So again, just to reiterate, this is not um, in any way official knowledge, it's not necessarily expert. This has very much come out of a hack that is saying if you have no other alternatives to use this and you don't have access to good uh, like restrooms or toilets to wash your hands properly, this might be a useful alternative just to get you out of a pinch. So I hope that's useful. Thanks very much.